Hey guys, Fixture here, and today I'm going to be talking about the DLC release dates for Sword Art Online Hollow Realization. So, Bandai Namco have just announced the first of three chapters in the Sword Art Online downloadable expansion story, Abyss of the Shrine Maiden, will be coming out on April the 26th in Japan, which is actually tomorrow, and May the 16th in North America and Europe, which is next month. So, the, uh, there's a short overview of the first chapter from Bandai Namco, and it is the first downloadable content will put you in the shoes of Kirito and his friends once more. A new stage in Ironcrad Castle where flame and earth, magma and heat waves dominate the atmosphere will be the main scenario. Defeating Bane, the Crimson Demon, is the target. But while the group is trying to clear this incredible new stage, Premier suddenly complained of a headache. What is going to happen? At the same time, a mysterious masked person makes his appearance. Will it be ally or a new enemy? With the main new main scenario comes a new heroine quest, where you have the chance to add Asuna, Elizabeth, Silica and Premier as a heroine in the first chapter, Enigma Order Quest, where you can acquire the precious Fuse Paragon, Mystic, and Organa GP Order items, and skill for becoming more powerful as never before. And also extra customization to change the appearance of the main characters. So it does look like this DLC is going to be taking place in that fire area we saw in like the first ever Hollow Realization trailer, so I'm kind of disappointed because it seems like it was cut out of the base game and made DLC. But at least we're finally getting the DLC. And also, the new appearances for characters, I know the update should come out around this time in the DLC, and that will be the character customization update with transmogs. Pretty much if you don't know what transmog is, pretty much you get a gear that looks nice, and a gear with good stats, you kind of fuse it, so it's got the appearance of the good looking gear, but the stats of the good stats gear. And Bandai Namco also teased that the second chapter will be the pretty much the same, but it will be an icy area. And the third chapter unlocked the new characters Alice and Nugio, who, if you've read the light novels, they're from... I don't know, I don't even know how you pronounce the whatever the third season's gonna be, that part. Alicillation or something like that. And also if you've played Memory Defrag, they were added to Memory Defrag a while ago. And they are actually gonna be added as Axel World vs. Lost Axel World vs. Sword Online DLC. Which is really cool, because Alice seems pretty cool. And also we're gonna get a sleep in for both of them. So that is it for this video. If you did enjoy it, please leave a like and a comment, and I'll see you guys soon for more videos. Adios.